show me love that I never knew. Oh, my morning dew. I can't stop thinking of you. Yeah, you set me on fire. You take my love in go yeah. You alone me desire. You want to come with desire. Yeah, yeah, my baby. My sherry. My baby. My sherry. My baby. My sherry. Nobody take it. Oh, hold on, let me take a picture of you and I. Okay. Now, this smell, don't mind. I'm going to pick him in that Yeah. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Look at me now. Gentlemen, I hope you guys get your black pants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Days 
my breath away And they can say what they want, girl, don't mind As long as you are by my side Begin at tunes like beard.com. Girl, I love you not ever know You stole my heart 
go, my heart, but I like it, oh, yeah. hey. Just to prove my love all the time I lie If I break your heart, then let me die Baby, oh, baby, oh From here to the end of the world, just to prove her love. But when a man is lost, he really don't understand what's right or wrong. Won't you know it's not my fault? Blame the devil. Girl, it's not my fault. Yeah. Blame the devil. Girl, I wanna make it right. Yeah. Blame the devil. Start, yeah. Though I messed up, yeah. Now I'm all alone. Pray for the day you will come from. Tell me to come home, yeah. Now I'm all alone. Wait for the day you come from. Oh, tell me to come home, yeah. Wish I could buy the hands of time. Baby girl, I know that you're the one Was a young and I took your love for fun I admit everything that I did was wrong Wish I couldn't buy the hands of time Baby girl, I know that you're the one Was a young and I took your love for fun I admit everything that I did was wrong I wanna warm my love She 
can even run from here to the end of the world Just to be heard of When a man is lost oh, He really don't understand what's right or wrong Won't you know it's not my fault To blame the devil It's 
the little things that make our hearts meet. It's like I can hardly breathe when you say my name. I know we've waited and we've prayed. Oh, darling, say my name. I know we've waited and we've prayed, and here we are for a lifetime.
close the door. All the I've been hearing in your name. From the moment that I wake up. matrimony 
It is an honorable estate, instituted of God, signify unto us the mystical union that is between Christ and his church. The honorable estate Christ adore and beautify with his presence and first miracle in Canaan of Galilee. It is commanded in the scripture to be honorable among all, and therefore it is not by any to be entered into unadvisably or literally, but reverently, directly, advisably, solely, in the fear of God, into this holy estate, these two persons present come now to be joined. Amen. Amen. Who gave this woman to be married to this man? Who gave this woman to be married to this man? Why? Not to me. Let it hear. Sorry. That's all. It's fine. My name is Prima Koma. I do. Relationship? Relationship? All right. Please give me a hand. Please give me your hand. Give it to me. All right. Your son is going. Thank you very much. You are no one in charge. Thank you very much. Thank you, Jesus. In that moment, will you take? Maria to Songa, Songo, Songa, Songa, beautiful. To be a wedded wife, to live together at, after God's ordinance. Now take your attention to this. To live together after God's ordinance. Not your ordinance, not traditional ordinance, not Liberian ordinance or Serenian ordinance, but after God's ordinance in holy essence of matrimony. When you love her, comfort her. You read the message about love. Honor her. Keep her. And listen to these words. Will you love her? Comfort her. Honor her. African men. Will you love her? Respect her and honor her. Well done. Honor her and keep her. In sickness and in health. And we'll African men will honor our wife. Will you honor this woman? Beautiful. In secret, in sickness and in health. Forsaken all others. Now forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto her, so long as you both shall live. If you do, please respond. Yes, do. Big Papa! Big Papa! Thank you very much. Hello. <laughs> now, Maria to Sandra, will you take Emmanuel Mondo to be your wedded husband? To live together after God's ordinance. And that's the premise of relationship. We are in the church to remind us it is a marriage that God is connected to. That when you take him after God's ordinance in holy estate of matrimony, when you love him, comfort him, honor him, keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto him as long as you both shall live. If you do, say please, I do. Yes, I do. The good thing that I'm clapping with my own is in challenges. That's why you're here. And you promise to do no matter what comes your way. Don't make your story in your family. They have their own journey to live with God. Amen. Beautiful. No change I love that. Thank you. Thank you for joining the process. No change of So we're we'll talking about law. The scripture is the first Corinthians. That talks about love. And love is the premise for all things. The Bible says, God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son. And He said, as we just read, that love is unconditional. And that is where the real challenge is. You know, is sometimes we love people because of the way they look, we love them because we enjoy having sex with them. We love them because they have money. We love them because they have something that look attractive. Those are love that will fail. 
as the woman grows older, sex may cease or the man may cease. As the time changes, finances may disappear. The love of God never ceases. It means whether there is good or bad, that love will never fail. That's the premise of a relationship. That's not a relationship that means there will be challenges coming. But love is the premise for your relationship. That say love is unconditional. That means there is no condition. No condition. You may hear some stories that are uncomfortable. But love never ceases. Even though he's not doing well. But God's love never ceases. When the love of God is what God will be at, if God did not love us, we not be at. Because God's love is unconditional. Marriage is only stay because there is genuine love from God. Yes. That love that is unconditional. Does that mean you don't have stories? There are stories in every relationship. Stories that are very uncomfortable, may not be very comfortable to others. And the stories in the relationship may not work with other places. God share with other people. Their story may be different from yours. You are not meant to bring their story in your family. Because the grace that God gave you, now is the grace models are carry. And the God that called you is faithful to renew with you. And he's a God of all love. And this faithful God will never cease in Jesus' master's name. Amen. And be glorified.
this ring. With this ring. I do well. Keep going, gradually come up. With this ring, we're going down graduates. With this ring. I in thee word. I in word. I in thee word. I in thee word. In the name of the Father, we keep going down. Father. In the name of the Son, keep going down graduates. In the name of the blessed Holy Spirit. In the name of the blessed Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. I do it. I do it. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Son. In the, the blessed Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Alright, let's get the candle. Let's get the candle. You can now do your offer out to the candle. Where's the candle, please, for them?
I'm saying please, please, and please, please stay in your seat. Today is the day. Amen. Give the chance to majestically march out of the sanctuary. Amen. And then you will follow and go set up the at the well at the reception. Amen. Very responsible guy, 
and in the Chinese man. He is finally the CEO and founder of the Salon Outing. For some of you who have been around Philadelphia for the past five or six years, excluding the pandemic, you know who this gentleman is. This man is the former vice president of the mighty All People's Congress Party in Pennsylvania. Ladies and gentlemen, this man, when he speaks like a white man, and that is because he's the degree holder, right? Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. D, are you ready for me to bring the MC for the protection? Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Akim Gavici, commonly known as the Gav. I know. How is that? Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to bring in the bride's fairies together with the entire family. Please welcome Mrs. Kadia Tusonga, Brian Kamara, after Brian Koma, and Lisa and Mrs. Mansaray.
Lord, we thank you and we bless you, Lord, for this union today. Because of your many blessings and mercy, Lord, you have brought us thus far. As Lord, we have united this family through holy matrimony, Lord. We pray, Father God, that your presence and your law be a blueprint that will keep their union together. That we have together for their draw two families together to be one. We pray, Lord, that you, God, will continue to shower your blessing in your own. We thank you, Lord, for those that have come to grace this occasion today and for the many gifts of love and blessings that they have shared with them, Lord, as we leave here. We are not living for your presence, Lord. But may your Holy Spirit continue to unite our hearts and minds together in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Reverend. God bless you. Um, it's always good to recognize the presence of God. Right where I was going on, some people were busy talking. Just know that I mean, God already marked your name in your face now. Because you do not respect His word. Hallelujah. Ladies and gentlemen, Yes, I think this is the guy. And I've been praying day and night to see you through this world of ordeal. And thank God we are here tonight raising this particular occasion. For real. Um, all I have to say is I give you my blessings. May the Almighty Allah really bless this union. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. That was short and sweet, Mr. DJ. They really want to appreciate the chief organizer for a job well done. She went above and beyond to make this night a special night. No other person, I think she's outside the drag a coat. But I have to call her inside. Keep on getting it down. No other person but Mrs. Kadi Kamanda of Mabwande. Mrs. Nijin. Let's go.
people excited about the world. But I just want everybody to really teach them so very much. Miss Amy, wherever you are, I don't know what to say. My meeting, Kadi, Elijah, and Elijah, so much of you. For my side, I mean, I just thank you, thank you, thank you, everybody. God bless you all. Thank you. Okay. You want to go table to table? You want to go around? Okay, let's go. I want to thank you so much for coming out tonight. We'll be there in house. No matter where you are, we are Africans. We are the Arabs. I want to thank you all. Excuse me. I'm sorry. One more question. The entire concept that is on me before and now. My daughter, the one I had the whole thing, but my children, they dressed me. And my nephew, and the person they call, they free. Whenever I take pictures, they put in. I don't want to leave that out. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, my cousin, I just want to thank everybody who came to my wonderful lunch here at the Living Hotel for giving me this opportunity to share this program. And thank you very much, Matthew. Thanks for the opportunity. It's a blessing and it's an honor to meet. Great love you like you people tonight. Thank you guys so much. I want to meet you guys again. Thank you, Salarius.